Hello everyone. Today, we're exploring Mycapsa, also known by its generic name, Octreotide. As always, this discussion is for educational purposes. If you have any health-related questions or concerns, it's important to consult a medical professional. Description Mycapsa, or octreotide, is an oral capsule used in the treatment of acromegaly, a condition characterized by excessive growth hormone production, typically caused by a pituitary tumor. Octreotide is a somatostatin analog that works by reducing the levels of growth hormone and insulin-like growth factor 1, IGF-1, in the body, helping to control the symptoms of acromegaly. Traditionally administered via injections, Mycapsa provides a more convenient oral option, approved by the FDA to help patients manage their symptoms with less frequent dosing requirements. Warnings Mycapsa should be used with caution in patients with gallbladder disease, as it can increase the risk of gallstones. Additionally, it may affect blood sugar levels, so those with diabetes or other blood sugar management issues should monitor their condition closely while on this medication. Patients with thyroid disorders should also consult their doctor, as mycapsa can alter thyroid function. Before taking this medicine, inform your healthcare provider if you have a history of heart conditions, kidney, or liver disease, as these may influence how you should use mycapsa. Be sure to discuss any allergies to medications, especially to octreotide or similar drugs. If you are pregnant, planning to become pregnant, or breastfeeding, it's essential to discuss the potential risks and benefits of mycapsa with your healthcare provider. Regular monitoring of your condition and blood tests may be necessary to adjust the treatment effectively. Side effects Mycapsa can cause a range of side effects. Common ones include gastrointestinal symptoms such as nausea, abdominal pain, bloating, and diarrhea. Some patients may experience headaches, dizziness, or fatigue. More serious side effects could include gallstones, changes in blood sugar levels, and thyroid function disturbances. Any new or worsening symptoms should be reported to your healthcare provider promptly. Interactions Mycapsa may interact with other medications, altering their effects. It's crucial to inform your doctor about all medications, supplements, and herbal products you are currently using. Special attention should be given to drugs that are metabolized by the liver, as mycapsa can affect liver enzyme activity and potentially change the drug levels in your blood. Dosage The proper dosage of mycapsa is crucial for its effectiveness. Typically, the starting dose is prescribed by your doctor based on your individual health needs and response to treatment. It's important to follow your doctor's instructions precisely and not adjust your dose without consulting them. Regular follow-up appointments will help ensure that the medication is working as intended and allows for any necessary adjustments. Avoid. While taking mycapsa, staying hydrated is advisable, especially if you experience gastrointestinal side effects like diarrhea. Patients should be careful when rising from sitting or lying positions if they experience dizziness. Alcohol can intensify certain side effects and should be consumed with caution or avoided altogether. FAQ. A common question about mycapsa relates to age restrictions. Currently, its safety and efficacy in individuals under 18 years old have not been established. Always consult with a healthcare provider for any specific queries related to this medication. Closing That concludes our overview of mycapsa. This information is intended to educate and should not replace the advice of a medical professional. Always consult with a healthcare provider for any questions or concerns regarding your treatment. Thank you for joining us today.